Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, it is Saturday morning. You know what I do. Go ahead and open these up. So we get a little sunlight in the room. Get a little sunlight. Sunlight, sunlight. So I don't know why I got all these water bottles sitting over here. That one's almost done. So, yeah, um, Walter and I, we are on our way to get something to eat. And then I'm just going to come back home. Go, right? Okay, you guys, here is my outfit of today. This is what I'm going to wear. Yes, I have the meat out, as my brother call it. I can still get my hands in my pants. Yeah, and then I got a little meat, my little this part showing which i never show this part of my body but you know whatever and oh shoot my hand i'm sorry about that <clears throat> and yeah y'all know i'll be i'll be hiking my stuff all the way up to my damn uh u-haul that'd be me doing that i'll be wanting stuff all the way up in my titty i don't know why that just just always been me if you know me and you grew up with me you know i like hiking my stuff all the way up to my titty for some reason, I don't know. I don't know. I just feel comfortable with it sitting up there. I don't know. I don't. I know. I really think that's from being talked about uh, from your from your parents and classmates. Like, cause you, I had a. I've always had a big bottom, and I've always been talked about. So I think that's where it come from. I be trying to like pull my clothes up, pull hide my body, pretty much. But. I love me. I love. Okay, you guys, I am back. So I have my. Why well, is this called the Waist King? Waist, Waist King. But anyway, this is what I've been using to uh, work out in and to uh, help keep my keep my body snatched or keep my my. <clears throat> waist in. Keep my stomach in, my waist in. However, you guys, I told y'all that um, Walter and I, we are on a um, fit challenge just to be healthy because of my new diagnosis and things that I'm going through. So in order for me to still be here um, for a little bit longer, Try to make it through my, what? Make it through my 60s and my 50s and my 60s. I take 60. I take 72. 90? I don't think so. I don't want to be here till 90, but you know, it is what it is. If I'm here till 90, it ain't my doing. It's the Lord's doings. But anyway, so... Actually, like, I actually really kind of really like my body. Like, I don't want no, I don't want no little bitty skinny ass pearly body. I, I like a little bit of, I've always, I've always said this because the little, the, the short little chunky girls, not short, short, but the girls that had like a medium, a, a medium bust, uh, some hips and a small waist. I always thought they were really, really cute. Like growing up, I thought those girls was really, really cute. And I was like, I wish my body looked like that. But no, <laughs> I had to walk around and look like I had a diaper on. Because I always had a big booty, but I didn't have um, a top. So what people pay for is how my body has always been. And I guess I'm like, I, I don't understand. I don't, I don't, I don't understand. But however, I never had a waist until I went through, I mean, I never, yeah, I never had fat stomach. I never had bloating or anything until I got married, my second go around, my second marriage. And in my second marriage, I had a hysterectomy. So, um, I went through, uh, post, um, what is it? Um, the little minute, the thing that just left me, uh, what is it called? Menopause. Yes. I'm sorry. It just, I, yeah, I'm in my menopausal. Well, I'm past menopause. I, I went through menopause in my forties. 
So, well, at the age of 40. So, yeah. So, I've never been, actually, I've never been this, actually, this big up until my second marriage. I was very, very small. Um, I weighed probably, on a good day where I was just eating reckless, I probably weighed 120. Like, I went from 89 pounds to carrying a baby at 120 and then back down to 89, 89, 90. So I've not been uh, that big, but up until this time, yes, I have. But anyway, so this is me. Hey you guys, so I'm going to go to Walmart and try to do a some Walmart shopping to find a few pieces of clothing for uh, my wardrobe for the winter. I'm trying to step my step my wardrobe game up. I need to find me a camera something a dashboard something for the dashboard no my dumb stuff don't mean me trying to be doing dashboard vlogging I'm going by myself you know y'all y'all know I have a problem with myself y'all know I tend to not want to do stuff on my own. However, during the day, I think I can. It's just, that's my own insecurities. My own, like, I've been told so much, you know, people try to make it seem like just because I can't see that I'm retarded. Or I can't comprehend things, but I can. Or like my mom used to say, you can drive. I'm like, they gave me a driver's license. I would assume that I can drive if they gave me a driver's license. Um, I don't know. Okay. Hey, you guys. I am back. So, I'm on my way back home. Y'all, I didn't spent just on the food alone. I mean, just on the clothes alone. I think I spent a little under um, $190. And then I added a few things on there, like my tomatoes my cucumbers <coughs> and my, <coughs> my apples because we're about to have a salmon salad tonight so yeah um i'll see you guys back at the house so we can hey guys i just wanted to share this before i go in the house <coughs> lord i need to breathe the tree you guys i had so much fun going shopping <coughs> I had so much fun going shopping by myself. Like, y'all, like, I would... <coughs> <coughs> y'all, you would think that going shopping with other people would be fun. It's really actually not because people are very selfish. And anytime, anytime I go shopping with people... It's always they want to go see what they want. No, no, me, 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 me. I want to this, 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 this. And then like stores that I want to go to, I really can't uh, go see those stores because I give up my power and decide to let them manipulate or take over the whole the situation of shopping. I can't. Let me tell y'all, I'm so happy that I found the strength to actually get up and take myself to Walmart because I was I wasn't gonna go to Walmart and and do any quick clothing shopping, which y'all <clears throat> Walmart has some really nice finds if you're looking for the really nice finds. Like y'all, when I show y'all this haul of these pieces that I got, and I actually put a few pieces back because I some of them were probably not something that I would wear like to work because it had like a hood or something on it and I wouldn't wear um shirts with hoods on it at work however you guys 
<clears throat> I just forgot. I can do a JC Penny haul. I have a JC Penny um, haul that I just um, hauled, and I have this Walmart haul, and we're about to go ahead in here and do the Home Goods haul. Um, Y'all, I'm gonna stop this this shopping, <laughs> girl. You you I I didn't put a dent. I didn't put like a huge major dent in my my financial my banking account i put a den in there but however me putting that den in you guys i really don't buy a lot of stuff for myself i might buy things for the house here and there um but i really don't buy stuff like specifically for the house so let me get out of this hot car and let's go back in